everyone. Welcome to Mother Goose Storytime. I'm Miss Shanna from the Muncie Public Library. If you haven't seen any of these before, Mother Goose Storytime is designed for babies and toddlers from birth to 36 months. We'll be doing a variety of songs and rhymes as well as a story. And you will notice some of the songs and rhymes do repeat. And that's just because it's very good for babies to give them a better chance to learn the songs. And of course, since you're watching this on a screen, babies probably can't pay attention to the screen. So it's just really important for you to interact with your baby, sing along to, with the songs, say the rhymes with me, and it'll make it a lot more fun. All right, should we get started? We're gonna sing our hello song. Here we go. Hello, hello, it's time to come and play. Hello. Hello, let's have some fun today. Let's clap our hands. Wiggle our toes. Here, wiggle our toes. Shake our bottoms. Shake, shake, shake. Hug and kiss and away we go. Oh, great job. And another song I like to sing that's very welcoming is The More We Get Together because I love getting together with all of you. We're gonna sing. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be, because your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. Great job. Hopefully if you've been watching these, you're starting to learn those songs because we do those every time. And we're gonna do some bounces. Babies love to bounce. And of course, when you're bouncing your baby, they can face toward the screen if they're a little older, or especially if they're little, you can lay them on your lap or face them towards you so you can interact very well with your baby. So we're gonna start with our rocking horse, rickety rockety rocking horse. We did this one in another video. If you haven't seen that, make sure you check it out. You know, bounce, rickety rickety rocking horse. Over the fields we go, rickety rickety rocking horse. Giddy up, giddy up, whoa. So when you get to the end, you can, Lean your child back, it's a lot of fun and they'll look forward to that. We're gonna do it a second time. I'm gonna go rickety, rickety, rocking horse. Over the fields we go. Rickety, rickety, rocking horse. Giddy up, giddy up, whoa! Oh, very good. Our next one is gonna be popcorn. Who likes popcorn? I love popcorn. Popcorn, popcorn, sizzling in the pan. Shake it up, shake it up as fast as you can. Popcorn, popcorn, now it's getting hot. Shake it, shake it, pop, pop, pop. Oh, it's a lot of fun for your baby to get lifted up. Gently, of course, if they're very little. So always be careful and mindful of the age appropriateness since I know we have kiddos from a lot of different ages may be watching. We're gonna do popcorn again now that you've heard it. Are you ready? Popcorn, popcorn, sizzling in the pan. Shake it up, shake it up as fast as you can. Popcorn, popcorn, now it's getting hot. Shake it up, shake it up. Pop, pop, pop. <gasps> Great job. We got one more, and this is a traditional rhyme you might have heard. And we're just gonna bounce along to it. You can take any rhyme or song and bounce your baby because they're gonna love that. So we're gonna do to market, to market. Here we go. We're gonna say, to market, to market, to buy a fat pig. Home again, home again, jiggity jig. To market, to market, to buy a fat hog. Home again, home again, jiggity jog. Did you guys know that one? We'll do it one more time because babies love it when you repeat. <gasps> to market, to market, to buy a fat pig. Home again, home again, jiggity jig. To market, to market, to buy a fat hog. 
Home again, home again, diggity dog. <gasps> Great job. All right, we're gonna hear our story. Today's story is called Lunch, and it was written and illustrated by Denise Fleming. It's got a mouse, I like mouse. He says squeak, have you ever heard a mouse squeak? Here it is. <gasps> mouse was very hungry. He was so hungry. He ate a crisp white. You see the color white? I wonder what kind of vegetable this is. <gasps> turnip. Ooh, has anybody ever ate a turnip? Tasty orange. <gasps> Should we see what vegetables that is? Carrots, oh, I love carrots. Sweet yellow, oh, what kind of vegetable? Corn, oh, one of my favorites. Tender green, what oh, do we see the green? What's a green vegetable? Peas, oh, peas are my second favorite. Oh, and now he's got dessert, tart blue. Berries, oh, I love blueberries. Sour purple. Grapes, yum. Shiny red. Oh, I wonder what a red fruit might be. Apples, ooh, those look good. And juicy pink, oh, do you see this? Pink. Let's see what it is. <gasps> watermelon. Oh, I love watermelon. Sh crunchy black seeds and all. Oh, do you see the black seed he's eating? Then, oh, what's he going to do now that he's ate all that food? <gasps> he took a nap until... Dinner time! And that's the end. Can you believe how much he ate? Now we had a story with a mouse, so now we're gonna have a rhyme with a mouse. It's Hickory Dickory Dock. We're gonna say this one twice, so you guys at home can say it along. Are you guys ready? Here we go. Hickory Dickory Dock, the mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one, the mouse ran down. Hickory dickory dock. We're gonna do one more time. Here's our mouse. Hickory dickory dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one, the mouse ran down. Hickory dickory dock. Great job. It's fun to learn some new rhymes or to say ones that you already know. Now we're gonna do a song, Head, Shoulders, Knees, and Toes. You might know this one. And this song is really great for little ones to get up and move, to practice their body parts. So you have a toddler, they can do the moves. Or if you have a baby, then you can point to their body parts so they can learn them. So we're gonna get started. We're gonna go. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Eyes, and ears, and mouth, and nose. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. <gasps> Great job! Now we're gonna do a rhyme about our fingers. And so again, the toddlers, they can make the moves. Or if you have a little one, you'll want to face them toward you and you can move your fingers in front of them and they'll find that really interesting. So that'll be fun. Are you guys ready? We're gonna go, I have 10 little fingers. They all belong to me. I can make them do things. Would you like to see? I can shut them up tight or open them wide. 
I can put them together or make them all hide. I can make them jump high or put them down low. And I can fold them up quietly and hold them just so. Great job. That one is a lot of fun. Always get to practice fine motor skills, moving our fingers. And we're going to do our song, Up So High. So older kids, if you have any sort of instrument, like a shaker rig or a rattle, you can use that. Or we can use our bodies. Toddlers can move up and down. Or if you have an infant, you can lift them up and down, which is what I'll demonstrate with Mr. Monkey here. Are you guys ready? Here we go. Up so high, down so low, give a little shake and around we go. Up so high, down so low, give a little shake, now hold them so. <gasps> Great job. That one's a lot of fun, I like to sing. We've got one more song today. It's our goodbye song. Are you guys ready to sing goodbye with me? All right, here we go. Goodbye, goodbye, everyone. Now we all have had our fun. Reach up high and stretch just so. Now wave goodbye, it's time to go. Goodbye, goodbye, everyone. Watch again for lots more fun. Thank you all for watching this story time. Do check out our other story time videos and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.